Welcome to iLector Online. Now here our second example asks us if we have enough information up there to determine if A and B are parallel to one another. Well, we're always looking for corresponding angles and so we're given the angle 75 degrees here, but we don't have the angle here. And then we're given this angle here, but we're not given its corresponding angle there. So at first sight it would seem we don't have enough information. But then we realize that supplementary angles must add up to 180 degrees. So this angle here and this angle here are supplementary angles because those two angles add up to the total of 180 degrees because they smack up against a single line like that. So therefore we can say that this angle right here must be 180 degrees minus this angle 105 degrees because we know that they add up to 180 degrees. So this is equal to 75 degrees. And now we can see that the two corresponding angles, this angle right here and this angle right here, are congruent. They do have the same angle measure and therefore we can conclude that yes, lines A and B are indeed parallel. And that is how it's done.